The Milwaukee Admirals return to action tonight in Cleveland to take on the Lake Erie Monsters. They'll also play the Monsters Thursday night in Cleveland at Quicken Loans Arena. Now, Milwaukee has bounced back and forth in the wins and loss column lately. They did lose at Chicago on Saturday. 2-1 to one was the final score in that contest. The Admirals looking to bounce back and this week in a tight, tight Central Division race. Only two points separate the top four teams. As it stands right now, points percentage-wise, Rockford in first place with 70 points. Milwaukee second with 69, Grand Rapids third with 68, and Lake Erie is fourth. They have 69 points, but they've played more games, so their points percentage is a bit lower than the Griffins this season. Big news yesterday is Admirals defenseman Jimmy Olaney signed a two-year contract extension to remain with the Admirals. The, we spoke with Jimmy Olaney about that contract extension and about the way the team is playing. So congratulations. A two-year contract to stay in Milwaukee for the next couple of seasons. It's pretty exciting. Yeah, I'm very excited to... Uh be in Milwaukee for the next two years. Uh, the next two years. Yeah. Pretty excited. Yeah. Let's talk a little bit about how this came down because it it, it comes down today. It becomes official today. Um, why why the decision to do it like this? Um, I thought I thought it was pretty nice to have a, at least two years and be guaranteed for two years. And mm -hmm. uh, um, I don't know. My agent came up with that with uh, um, Paul, mm -hmm. and uh, I guess it worked out fine like that. It, it's nice to have the security. If you're going to sign an American Hockey League contract, it's mm -hmm. nice to have some security, right? Yeah, it's nice because uh, you never know what could happen, and uh, it's really nice to know where I'm going finally. You know, I, I know I'm going to be here in the next two, two years, mm -hmm. and um, yeah, I'm pretty excited about that. You know, the nice thing about it too, on top of the security, is the fact that say another team, an NHL team, even Nashville, I guess, but an NHL team calls, you can sign a new contract with the NHL team, an entry-level deal with them, right? Yeah, that's, let's say the goal is uh, to sign an entry-level with the Nashville, but you never know, uh, you know if uh, an entry-level gets, gets uh, you know, any opportunity or something. Mm -hmm. uh, for sure, I hope it's going to be, it could be a Nashville, but, uh, you know, uh, and entry level would be nice too. But again, and the two year deal, it gets us some security and it gets you kind of more established in what has become your home away from home, right? Yeah, I'm pretty excited. To, it's going to be my, uh, uh, the end of it. It's going to, uh, I'm going to spend four years, I think, here. So that's that's really nice. I really I really like playing here, so I was pretty excited. That Let's talk real quick about the road trip to Cleveland. They're playing well. You guys are playing well, coming off a tough loss in Chicago. But uh, these are two two big games for you guys here. Yeah, very big. Yeah, they're huge games, especially that uh, uh, Lake Erie are pretty close to us in the standings too. So uh, yeah, it's two huge games, and we we've been up and down in the in the past couple of games. So uh, it'd be good for us to get a. To get a, get the things going a little absolutely, bit. Absolutely, absolutely. Congratulations and good luck. Thank you very much. All right, that's Jimmy Olaney. Face off tonight at Quick and Loans Arena in Cleveland is at six o'clock. Pre-game coverage starts at five thirty on Sports Radio one hundred five seven FM. The fan. The same two teams will meet Thursday at the same time. The Admirals return home on Saturday night at seven o'clock. It's Colton Sisson's bobblehead night that night. For more information, go to milwaukeeadmirals.com. Of course, you can watch all Admirals games on ahllive.com.